Hey guys, I'm Ujwal and today I'm sharing some fun gift tags using the mom to be collection. I'll also be using the reactive foil, the butterfly dies and of course the coordinating motif sheets. So let's start by picking out a couple of pattern papers from this gorgeous gorgeous paper pack and um, now first of all I'm going to create a little base for my tags. So I'm going to cut this 12 inch by 12 inch sheet into uh, 6 by 12 inch into half and then I'm going to cut uh, it at 4 inches each so you will get a 4 inch by 6 inch piece here this will make for the base of our tags uh, next I have this very pretty alphabet scrabble theme kind of a sheet here which I'm going to tear with my hand to have that ragged texture and I'm going to just break it down into smaller creases to fit those tags so the idea is to add a few different layers um, on these tags and make them really sweet and as well as beautiful at the same time so you can see I'm just uh, tearing the paper and I've added them to all of our card pieces now before we start adding i wanted to add some texture on the base itself so i'm using the stencil uh, again from dress my craft and i will be using uh, my gel medium uh, here today i just wanted to experiment and see how it will react with the foil so i'm using an old card and just adding uh, the gel using the stencil at random places on the tag bases just like so and once I'm done with this I'm going to let these um, let this layer dry a little bit so that it can catch um, the foil better so while those are drying let's die cut uh, some of these beautiful butterfly butterflies in um, using this gold mirror paper um, they look really really stick uh, stunning they have this very intricate detailing and you can see how beautiful they look together so now that the tags are dry too i'm going to use this reactive gold foil and i'm going to take this bone folder and start rubbing it a little bit aggressively um, i was a little bit too late in adding the foil to the gel medium before it dried out completely so i went in a little bit aggressively but you can see how beautiful um, that foiling looks on the tags so now that our bases are ready let's start adding the layers uh, so for gluing everything down i will be using my hot glue gun here because it just adds a little bit of dimension uh, between each layer and just makes them look makes them stand out a little bit i will also be using a layer of cheesecloth here uh, just shred it into pieces and I'm going to add it um, add a little bit a little piece on each of those tags now that so now that we have two layers on the tags I'm going for the third one I'm using this another piece of paper from the paper pack and again tearing it into pieces smaller ones than the first layer um, and I just again use the hot glue gun to add it onto the tags and now I'm using the satin twine in white uh, for the next layer and some lace um, to add more drama a little bit of shabby chicness and we can see I'm using the um, beautiful embellishments from the motif sheet that coordinates with the paper pack and now we are going to just start building this up uh, adding the sunflowers which is the theme in this paper pack and they look so so pretty a final step cut out that little corner those two corners on the top so that we have this tag shape so i'm going to repeat this process for all of the tags i'm going to vary the pregnant mom uh, motives that i'm using uh, on the tags uh, on each of these and basically follow the same process just um, place the embellishments a little bit differently uh, on each of them.
so now that all of the tags are ready I'm using uh, this little stamp that says congratulations and I'm going to add it to all of these tags and I think um, they will add a really cute personal touch for a mom to be gift maybe for a baby shower gift so I'm just stamping in black ink um, and we're going to cut it into little tags and then add it to um, our mom to be tags here just like so so now that I have all the tags complete you can see how pretty they look um, I think they just look really really wonderful and yeah I had so much fun making these I did end up and adding a little bit of um, twine on the top and that's it I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I did making them and I will see you again next time bye bye and take care